what yeah. led you to develop that or how did you come across the tools you needed to, to make your yeah, compass? Well, I think a lot of us start with the tools that are already readily available to us. You know, people journal, they use planners, they use their calendar, and those are all very <clears throat> reactive, I found. And then I, I joined a group for a while, executive coaching group called C12, which you may be familiar with. Yeah. And so there's a period of time that I was there, and that's when they introduced me to this sort of wheel concept where you sort of in a month or so evaluate how your life has been, you know, in, in your health financially with your family, things like that. And it really kind of blew my mind as a perspective or a way of doing thinking about how things have been in preparation for how you want them to be. And I hadn't mm. really thought that way. And so that's how it started. It has evolved every year. I I identify um, just a, a little bit more refinement to the questions I ask. And instead of using pre-existing stuff i actually now create my own and it's not a planner it's not a journal it's kind of a something in between and it's i hmm. call it a compass because it does help set my week and so there are a series of questions and it's not a lot it doesn't take me more than maybe 10 or 15 minutes to get through it but then it, it just kind of sets my day my day and then the days following until i get to the weekend um and it influences the decisions that i make and so i yeah. i find that very very helpful in um just trying to solve the problems that are in front of us without the answers are there a lot of times in our psyche and in our relationships yeah. and whatnot. We're just not thinking in that way. 